I was so depressed. Uh, I was almost suicidal. And um, my life from the outside looked wonderful. And I was miserable. I, I was an attorney for 20 years. And I hated dealing with conflict. I hated dealing with all these angry people who didn't want to do anything but, you know, be mean. <laughs> and, but it was like, everybody said I was doing great. And it's like, oh, hmm, what am I going to do about this? Um, but I didn't have any other direction to go into until one day uh, I was sitting in my office and I got tired. I just got tired. And it's like, hmm, I think I'm coming down with something. So I went home. I thought, oh, I'm getting the flu. Two weeks later, I ended up in the hospital dying. After doing a multitude of tests, the doctor sent me home to die because they didn't know what was wrong. They didn't know what to do about it. They didn't have any solutions. And it's like, mm, you want to die in the hospital? You want to die at home? Well, I think I'll go home. Um, and truly, uh, I was probably within three days of dying. And a friend of mine heard about this and she brought over a Cherokee shaman. My father was three quarter Cherokee, but I grew up in a city and he was far away from his roots. And I, I had been doing energy work and metaphysical work, but I had not connected to my Native American roots. And the Cherokee shaman came over and did a healing on me and literally brought me back from the brink of death. 